Do you want to use the ChatGPT image generator to create those action figure toys? Well, stay tuned, I'll show you how it works. You've probably already heard about the hype surrounding the visualization of action figures created with the ChatGPT image generator. I let myself be inspired a little and started a few experiments myself, not only with action figures, but also with plush toys and origami figures. I would like to show you how it works. Step 1. The start page of ChatGPT. I have prepared a few examples for you. The first is a firefighter with helmet and axe. I have uploaded a picture of myself and written a matching prompt for each example. Do you want an action figure in 90s retro style? Well, here it is. Do you want a classic toy figure dressed as a warrior with sword and shield? Voila! What I particularly like is the consistency of the head. If you look closely, you can see my own head. Always adapted to the type of figure, of course. Just action figures wasn't enough for me. That's why I developed a compatible prompt in collaboration with ChatGPT, which also allows me to be realised as a plush toy. I have to admit that this really fascinates me. Here too, my face is the basis for the realisation. If you want to use the prompts I've developed, just go to the description. I have compiled them all for you there, so you don't have to spend ages trying them out for yourself, but can simply copy the text into ChatGPT. As we already know, you can do a lot more with ChatGPT. That's why it was clear to me that I would like to see the plush toy unpacked, with a person looking at it in a first-person view. The possibilities are almost endless. Action figure. Okay, plush toy, good. Origami figure. That's exactly what's missing. A matching prompt brings us this result. But how does it all work? Back to step one. Go to the ChatGPT homepage, then click on these three dots in the prompt box. There you select Create Image. Now upload an image of your choice as the basis for the image creation. Since you want to have a character of yourself, this image must necessarily be one of you. It is important that this picture is relatively good, but the view of the upper body is sufficient. Then simply enter the following prompt here. Use this image to create a picture of a plastic action figure toy of a gardener from head to toe inside a clear blister package. Accessories, hose, flower and shovel. The package should read, the maker. By the way, the specification, from head to toe, is very important so that ChatGPT can create a full figure. If we now click on the white circle, the image creation process begins. You can see that my face is used as a template here too. Incidentally, I asked ChatGPT earlier, what's wrong with your image generator? Why does it take so long? Is there no fast or turbo mode? The answer came quickly. No, there isn't. For us as users, this means that we have to be a little more patient when creating the images. For this video, I have cropped the processes so that we don't have to wait forever. By the way, if you are interested, I have analysed the functionality of the ChatGPT image generator in a separate tutorial. You are welcome to take a look at it. You can find the reference link at the end of the tutorial or in the description. What explains the hype around these action figures is the fact that you can portray your own profession. Whether you're an engineer, designer or tax official, just enter it where I wrote gardener. Don't forget to change the accessories. This will create your own little figurine. The prompt adherence of the ChatGPT image generators is phenomenal. What you enter as a prompt is usually what you get as a result. I will also do another tutorial on this. In particular, the small but important details are also taken into account. In this example, I'm wearing an orange sweater with a collar. Consequently, the action figure also has an orange sweater with a collar. Pretty amazing. That's it for this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you very much for listening. See you soon. Your channel, AI, now you know.